And everybody, we're going to pray for those. Um, as the Lord mentions, different things that people need prayer for in this video. And um, I ask that everybody listening to this video come in agreement with me and pray for uh, those mentioned in this video and what we're asking God to heal. And as you know, as believers, He's the one that does the healing. And so we are going to ask Him to heal. And it's entirely up to Him. So with that being said, let's wait upon the Lord and pray uh, for prayer for those as He brings them to my mind. Lord, I, you want me to pray for someone who has an elbow surgery or elbow uh, soreness or ailment ligaments muscle what the joint in the elbow I just pray for that person that you would heal them in Jesus name fully restore their elbow heal them I pray in Jesus name someone has received a uh, like a, a has some sort of uh, crack on the edge of their mouth like right on the edge of your mouth like a really deep uh, cut whether it's from uh, sun exposure or something pray for healing for that There's someone that has a um, that has hit their head actually In this side of the head There's someone that has um, has scrapes and has uh, hit their head recently either by falling or bumping into something the Lord Jesus wants you to know the Father, wants you to know He loves you, and um, that He wants us as the body to pray for you, pray for your healing, pray for full recovery of that accident. Someone else has just recently been put in a brace on one of your legs, and I pray for your leg that to be healed in the name of Jesus, that you be just comforted by the Lord, and that... Um, you're in need of joy as you're in that situation that's causing you to have um, n uh, negative thoughts and uh, making you feel bummed out. And the Lord wants you to know he loves you and you shouldn't uh, let that get to you, that this is just a season and that you will be healed. And we pray for your quick recovery uh, concerning your leg. In the name of Jesus. Someone was recently cut by a, uh, a ribbon, like a burn and a cut. Maybe around, there's a uh, material that's a ribbon material that you were cut by. The Lord wants me to bring that attention and pray for your healing. Tell you how much he loves you and pray for your healing in Jesus' name. Someone's dealing with uh, something specific with their sinuses that you've dealt with for a long time. And um, it's something that you just deal with your entire life. And we just want to pray for your healing. Uh, you take medicine, allergy medicine and, and the like, but that doesn't seem to help. And we, we just lift that up to the Lord and ask the Lord Jesus Christ to heal you in Jesus' precious name. Someone has a burn on the side of their ear, on the edge of their ear. The Lord loves you. He's very much aware of your life and where you are. And we pray for your healing concerning that burn on the edge of your ear. Someone was in a situation recently that someone threw something at you, like a board or something, and hit you in the side, in the back area. Pray for your healing. In Jesus' precious name, that you would be healed, fully recovered from that incident.
There are some, as the scripture says, that you need to go to the elders of the church and let them anoint you with oil for healing. And if you are comfortable or know of someone enough to go and ask them to anoint you with oil, go. The Lord is saying, go, do that. Someone has stepped on some sort of nail onto their foot. Pray for healing concerning the, the injury to your foot in the name of Jesus. We all want to also uh, pray for those and there seem to be way more uh, emotional injuries and hurt than there is physical. And we just lift all those up, those who that applies to those different people listening to this video, that God would just move upon your heart and life, guard your, your, your heart, your emotions, your desire, and your mind, what you think in Christ Jesus, that you would receive his peace that passes all understanding, even now from the top of your head to the bottom of your feet. And the Lord wants me to say this, church, go comfort one another. Comfort each other with the comfort that you have been comforted by God. God has comforted you. And God wants you to go comfort other people as commanded in Scripture. God bless you guys. Have a great day.